always felt a little marginalized in my life. Like that I was kind of like an oddball, like I didn't belong. Poor Fast. Now I know. Poor Fast. I don't know if y'all heard about this, but there's been a tribunal in the UK <laughs> that has ruled that if you refer to a man as being bald, it is considered sexual harassment. It would be like going up and, and telling a lady that a you know certain particular you know part of her body was was attractive or interesting or or maybe without follicle. I don't know. You could say, man, you have beautiful hands. <gasps> you can't say I have beautiful hands. Well, calling a man bald is considered sexual harassment. Now. We have lost our minds. Yep. The ruling made by a panel of three men who pointed out their own lack of hair. Oh. Comes in a case between a veteran electrician and his employers. Anyway, so I can't say bald men. I can say, um, reminds me of, of, of a t-shirt I saw several years ago. I think on a gentleman who also was without hair. It said, uh, God made only a few perfect heads. The rest he covered with hair. That was my mom. That My mom told me that forever. <laughs> when, I, when, when it started to disappear, like I felt like David Copperfield had made my hair go away. Like just never came back. <laughs> I think this is insanity, right? Perhaps there's something that needs to be done about it, and Dad, blame it. We'll let you help in the fight against discrimination. Well, I'm just starting to realize how much more successful I could have been had I not been discriminated against. Bald men are being discriminated against in the workplace, and they need your help. Men are suffering. Men like Dwayne The Rock Johnson and Vin Diesel. Imagine how many more movies they'd make if they only had hair. Imagine how many more points Michael Jordan would have scored if he weren't follically challenged. Jeff Bezos would have way more money. Please donate to the Help the Bald Men Foundation. Support these unfortunate and helpless men like Jason Statham. Just don't mention Will Smith's wife, who is also a bald man. 